Hey guys, this is Stacy from eatthebite.com and today I'm making baked skillet potatoes with chorizo sausage. This one's so simple. We'll chop and cook a little chorizo sausage. We'll chop some onions, red pepper, green pepper, cube some potatoes. We'll add everything to the skillet with the sausage, add some adobo seasoning, a little bit of olive oil, mix it all together, and bake it in the oven. So, let me show you how to make it. We'll start with the chorizo sausage. We're going to cut off a large chunk, slice it into strips like you see here, and then we'll rotate the pile and cut it into smaller cubes from there. I'm going to cook that for a few minutes on medium heat off to the side while I continue my prep. I've got a couple of small chunks of onion and all we're doing here is slicing the onion into slivers and then dicing it down from there. You can use a small dice or larger chunks if you prefer. That one's up to you. Next up, red pepper. We'll do the same thing here. Cut off a chunk, and I do like to get rid of that white part before continuing, but that's just my preference. Then we're going to cut it into thin strips and then dice it down into small cubes from there. Got a green pepper too. I'm using poblano here, but bell pepper works great for this as well. We'll just cut that into strips and dice it down from there. And don't forget to stir the chorizo sausage that you've got cooking off to the side. It only takes about five minutes for these to cook. Now for the potatoes. We're going to cut our potatoes in half like this, and we'll take each of the halves and slice lengthwise down the middle right there. So one cut here and one there. Depending on the size of your potatoes, you'll make three or four cuts lengthwise, then rotate the pile and cut the potatoes into cubes. In order to get that 25 minute cook time, we want the cubes to be pretty small like you see here. So I've got my cooked chorizo. I'll add the potatoes, the peppers and onions, a little adobo seasoning, tiny bit of olive oil, then just mix to coat all the ingredients. And we'll cook this in a preheated oven at 425 degrees for about 25 minutes, turning the potatoes once at the 15 minute mark. I had some fresh herbs on hand, so I added a little parsley garnish to the top, and I also had some dill and added that as well. That's optional. And now it's time to eat the bite. These potatoes are so awesome and make a great side dish for your Sunday morning eggs. I highly recommend you give this one a try. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time.